all right guys if you haven't already this is monday the fifth you haven't already please put your first and last name on your packet today again is the fifth we got nine days until our break this week the items that are due for us we have our warm-up our homework and our quiz our quiz this week is going to be on parallel lines cut by a transversal so more angle measurement more angle measurement on this quiz friday okay but we're working on parallel lines cut by a transversal this week the agenda's on the sideboard I'm going to go over the warm up with you. Of course, we're going to write in our planner. We're going to write our goal down. You're going to take the quiz that's on Canvas. When you finish the quiz, please work on either your I Ready. If you haven't completed your I Ready project, I'm typing that grade in today. Or finish the snowman. If you finish with I Ready, then finish the snowman um, activity, okay? I'm going to pause for the calls. Please take out your planner, okay? All right, on our planner, we're in December now. This is December the 5th, so we're 12-5. And our goal this week, okay, for me is to make sure that I try my best to finish angle measurement this week. For you, it could be to make sure that you get the homework completed nightly if you're still struggling with that. Okay, ask for help, come to tutoring. Virtual tutoring is, to, is today, by the way, after school, three o'clock. If that day doesn't work for you again, please, only reason why I'm throwing those dates out there is because no one has really said what day works for them, okay? All right, let's go to a new page. This is week, it's week five. Woo, rolling. All right, at the top, this is from December the 5th, 22, all the way to December 9th. This is Q2, quarter two, week five. Quarter two, week five. Math eight homework. Do not forget that we have virtual tutoring today um, at 3 p.m. Raise your hand if you're interested so I'll know about who's coming in here. I know I have one in my next class. Okay, nobody's interested in here. All right. Um, your hand is. In, are you interested? Are you gonna come? Yay! The link is on Canvas. Okay. How long is it? Uh, it's up to you. Most of the time, I don't go past like thirty minutes. Okay. Um, so it's usually from like three to three thirty. You know, some people might have additional questions. Might last to three forty-five, but nothing past that. Um, homework help. Please watch the homework help video. Remember, it's posted on Canvas, and it's going to go to your Remind at 2 o'clock. So please make sure that you watch the video and complete homework. Let's look at the warm-up. Pause, give you a chance to write, and we're going to look at the warm-up. All right, let's look at the homework. I'm sorry, warm up. I said homework. Sorry, y'all. All right. Okay, section one only. Two or more, two more than a certain number is less than 
women is 15 less than twice the number. Find that number. Okay. So we got two more. So that's two plus or two plus something. All right. So we have two more than a certain number is, okay, it is um, 15 less than, oh, so 15 less goes first. Sorry, y'all. And I keep forgetting that I can't erase with this erasable pen. I'm so used to pencils not being able to erase. Two more than a certain number, so 2 plus x um, is 15, also we said we wrote it right, 15 less than, so minus 15, twice a number, so that's 2x, okay? When you use the word less than, the order reverses, okay? Twice the number, we don't know what the number is, so we're going to say x. You could use E N A B C D E F G. It doesn't matter, okay? When they say a certain number, you don't, and they didn't give you that number, use a variable. So two plus the variable is that's equal to less than. So reverse the order. It's minus fifteen, okay? Instead of fifteen minus something, it's gonna be minus fifteen. Fifteen goes last. What are you subtracting? Twice the number so that's two times that number that they was talking about that we don't know 2x all right so now let's solve in order to solve for x the x's have to be on the same side i'm gonna move the smaller one 1x this is a positive 1x so i'm gonna subtract 1x from both sides when i subtract 1x here the x's are gone on this side and i'm left with just the two i bring down my equal 2x minus 1x just gives me 1x, or I can just write just the x, minus 15. Okay, so now to get x by itself, we're going to get rid of the minus 15. The opposite of a minus 15 is to add 15 to both sides. 2 plus 15 gives me 17. Bring down the equal. On this side, negative 15 plus 15 is 0, and we're left with just the x. So 17 is equal to x, or x is equal to 7, 17. I'll go back and do this one tomorrow, okay? So we leave this one alone. This one I'm going to do tomorrow. I'm not going to do those, okay? This I'll do Tuesday. I'm going to pause for the calls. Section 2, go to the restroom, please. Take out your laptop so we can get logged in to to canvas and take our quiz if you're finished with the quiz those of you that did it in study skills please take out the snowman drawing or work on i ready